Welcome back. A new barber shop hopes to bring back old school tradition and a relaxing experience. They've got a vintage edge over the competition. It's this week's Alex Around Town. Kayla Collins runs the Vintage Edge Barber Shop. It's always been my ultimate goal and dream is to have my own shop or own business. But she wouldn't be where she is now without her mom. My mom has always been my biggest fan growing up. So knowing and having my mom there, that pushed me and said, hey, I know you can do whatever you want. You put your mind to, you know, as long as you put your mind to it, you can do it. But Collins had to overcome a big loss. Unfortunately, she passed away two years ago. After my mom passed, I knew it, was, it had to be a mission of mine to have my own business, to be able to show that I'd done it, and so I could make my mom proud no matter where she's at. And she's not doing it alone. She owns the shop with her fiancé, Patrick. We both push each other, you know, to, to not just level out and, and plateau somewhere. We both encourage each other to kind of keep going to the next level. It's awesome. You don't want to work with your uh, significant other and put both of our love for passion into, into the hair. They say barbering is an art form. Finally found my, I think, true calling, you know, the, the artistic realm of, of the art background and the free spirit of creating new things. And it's our artwork. It's our piece of art that you know, walks around outside every day. It's our business card, it's our portfolio. Most of all, they want to keep the industry buzzing. Not only a barbershop feel, but a spa and like relaxing type environment for guys to just say, hey, I'm done with work, sit down, relax, and don't, you know, have to worry about anything else. Barbering kind of was, 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 was getting to be a lost trade. Some folks just want to get in, want to get out. Other folks long for that old time uh, straight razor shave or detailed razor finish. So we're bringing that back. Kayla and Patrick say that unlike the shop before them in that location, they do take walk-ins. Kayla says that by the end of the year, they will have services that no other barber shop within 100 miles has. She hopes it will be a fun experience and something new for people to try.